Hey guys, in this video we're going to be taking a look at uh, basically a DC to DC step up converter uh, to boost the voltage um, from one DC device to another. Uh, this converter is made by a company called Drock and uh, it's a pretty small device, pretty simple and uh, does a great job. Basically you've got your uh, inputs right here, you've got your outputs there, uh, you've got a little dial right there which you can use and change it to basically adjust what your output voltage is anywhere from 5 volts to 40 volts. Uh, you've got a button right there which change between your input voltage and your output voltage. So you'll see right now it's set to 10 volts. Uh, we can go ahead and uh, we'll turn this and you can see we can start reducing our voltage. We can bring it all the way down to about 5 volts or so, that's the minimum. 4.9 and if we want we can crank it all the way up to uh, about 40 volts or so that is the maximum that this can handle so 39.9 as you can see right there uh, we cranked it up so the maximum output voltage this guy can do is about 40 volts so that's our range 5 to 40 so it's pretty handy if you want to uh, basically boost the voltage of some input source uh, you can do it quite a bit here um, one thing that I really like about it it's pretty easy to use and uh, one of the things is if you take a look at the actual connectors, they're not actually connectors where you need to solder in a device. Basically you just take your uh, positive and negative wires and you just insert them into there. And then you just need a little Phillips screwdriver. You can go in there and tighten the screw down and it basically pinches down on the cable to hold it in place. Plus it'll then, uh, you know, ensure the electrical connection is there and there you go. So really simple, no soldering required. So it makes it easier to attach. Uh, if you want to connect up maybe a different device or a different cable, you can do that really easily too because you don't have to unsolder anything. Um, you just unscrew it, pull it out, pop in the new one, and screw it back down. So really, really simple. I like it a lot. Uh, it does a great job. I've been powering some devices. I've just been putting about an amp through it. Um, no big deal. I know this one is rated for about 2.5 amps. They also make another one that's rated for up to 6 amps. I haven't tried the limit, so I couldn't tell you about that. Um, but it does do a great job as far as... Uh, you know, stepping up the voltage, I've been comparing it with uh, voltmeters and multimeters and all, and yep, that number is accurate. So, very nice, very simple. Take a look at the back. See, it's pretty simple there on the back as well. So, not much to it. You just got, you know, inputs, outputs, adjustment dial, and you can, you know, monitor input voltage, output voltage, and if you want, if you press and hold that button for three seconds, uh, it'll also turn off the LED display. So, you have that capacity as well. Still working, of course. Um, but just turning off the display. So, pretty handy device. Like it a lot. Uh, if you're watching this on Amazon, there's your review. Pretty simple and cool. If you're watching this on YouTube, I'll put a link in the video description to uh, the device so you can take a look at it and take a look at current pricing. So, there you go. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.